Y'all. Y'all gonna say it with me? Good morning. Good well, you see what's going on already? We got one who is flat. And then we got one who is talking about going to school. Anyways, good morning. I'll say it since they won't. Good morning, guys. Good morning. I look a little crazy. That's okay. But, good morning. Y'all. My little hair is finally growing, but it's going a little crazy. But anyway, y'all, good morning. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. Huh? Good morning. This morning. We are at... Can you tell your phone now? Yeah. I don't think it's yours. I think it's Kai okay, okay, guys. But, um, we are at Cadence. Can I show you? Can I show you? You can get up. You can get up. Come here. We're parked. Um, we're at Cadence's first therapy appointment, and I got all my kids with me. So, let's see how this goes. If you ever seen Mr. Beast? Look, my baby do it. And then fool Mr. Beast. Y'all, do you love those? Come on, keep singing. Cameron, you keep singing the same part. Well, then it had something to it. Oh, oh. What's the next part, Kenan? Go ahead. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Anyways, y'all, we got to get here before we're late. We are at Caden's first with his actual new therapist to see if he likes them. You excited? You nervous? No? 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 I'm excited. I got my, got, I have my, I have another appointment tomorrow, my therapy appointment. So, anyways, y'all, let me get in here. My hand's not. All right, y'all, pray for me because this morning I got, this is Caden's first appointment. So, it's like his intake, intake one, I'm guessing. And I got all my kids with me. So, I'm praying that they're good. God be with me. Yeah, look at him. Yeah, yeah. Look. I love me, me, six, down, Did you know Mr. Beast is rich? Is that better? Mm -hmm. And nice. He's really nice. Yeah, he is really nice, actually. He actually gives the people a lot of money. Well, he needs to come give, say, Mr. Beast, come give us some money. Hey, guys. We should get Starbucks after this. Yeah, we should. Y'all think they deserve Starbucks? We'll see. We'll see. We'll see how long it takes in here, okay? I wish I was literally a Mr. Beast. You are Mr. Beast. What? Mr. This joke is so bad. It looks like I just do it on the paper. All right, guys, come on. All right, I'll see you out here in a second. Y'all, one thing my baby gonna do is act the food. What? No. No, look. 
Yeah, I'm over here. This is Caden's therapy, not his. And I'm on the one in this therapy now. You want more drink? I just, listen, I just dropped my kids off at school from Katie's therapy appointment. And that was interesting. Kai Kai was not very happy, the, almost the whole appointment. So I struggled a little bit. And I typically don't struggle with my kids taking the places. But Kai was just not. Typically, you can just give Kai like a snack and his iPad and he'll chill. But he was not having it today. Like, <coughs> this is like the first time I've ever had to say, like, Kai Kai was really showing out a little bit. But I just want to get on here real quick and tell you guys that I know sometimes. It seems like, it, could, it probably seems like a lot of the things that I do for my kids or I'm able to do for my kids seems easy, but it's not. Today was a, a prime example where I'm, 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 my goal is to get Caden in and he had his first intake appointment and I got Kai Kai crying and screaming because he doesn't want to be in this room which I understand the room had no windows or anything so it was just like a room but and then Cameron it, it's very hard for Cameron to just sit somewhere and not ask questions and not answer the questions that are asked to Caden he's just it, it, he, it, it just it just comes like if there's nothing you can do to make him not do it he just He's always, he's always thinking about something. And then I got Caden who, and really honestly in those, like that time, he just needs me to be there, you know? And I feel like I can't be there. I couldn't be there the way that I wanted to be there today, you know? And I explained to his therapist, like, listen, I promise you, it's not always like this. Like, I got all my kids today. They are they are just not acting like themselves. And so many times I was just like, I just want to leave. Like I uh, maybe today's the wrong day for the appointment, and they'll they'll say please go home because Kai was Kai was lit since before we even got into the room. So, it's just been, I don't know, y'all. It's a lot. I'm ready to go to bed. That's what I'm ready to do. I'm ready to go to bed and try again tomorrow. Because I'll be defeated. But, then I get all excited and happy and motivated again. Because I realize that... Oh, I got some pretty flowers coming. I realize that... I, I'm... I, I'm doing what I need to for my kids to, you know, be kids and to just enjoy life and not worry. You know what I'm saying? And as hard as it is sometimes to think about the fact that I'm one person who I have therapy weekly. Now, on top of me having therapy weekly, Caden has therapy weekly. And then on top of Caden having therapy weekly, Cameron has therapy weekly, sometimes bi-weekly, you know? And then that's not even, that's just for us to be on the right mental place, be in the right mental place, you know? That's not everything else that has to get done throughout the week, you know? And sometimes it's intense. And I don't ever, I'm thankful. So I never ever want to come off like, oh, well me, you know. But today was hard. 
The day was rough. Now I'm home with Kai Kai and we just pulled up to the house and I just don't, he's just not happy. He didn't sleep last night. He's not happy today. Like, no, I took him to the doctor. They said, oh, he's got a little cold or something. He'll be fine or some allergies, which I decided to come home first. And then I'm going to put him down, get let him have a snack, put him down. Then we have to wake up and then I'm going to go try to get him some allergy medicine just to see if like that will help. See if it really is the allergies. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I really don't. I'm just surviving today. This is one of those early just surviving days. Because like, what? And one thing I tell myself often is like when I have these times where I'm just like defeated and I feel like there's just so much going on. I just think about like the end goal, you know? And in my head, I was like, oh, I can just reschedule this appointment because a time that I don't have to bring all my kids. But then I was like, but then that's gonna piss, push, who knows when I'll get an appointment? Cause it took me months to get this appointment. And if I, I'm like, I'm not, I'm not risking with everything that's been going on. I'm not risking not having my baby in his, his therapy just because it's going to be hard for me today, you know? So I got up with no sleep, got all the kids ready and I took them. And it was exhausting, but now I gotta get home. Now I'm home and it's crazy because I have to clean up because last night I decided I just wanted to rest. I wanted to take, I, I don't, I do never rest at the end of the night. Like I never rest at the end of the night. I am editing videos on YouTube, making shorts, doing something like that or sleeping. Like I never, I never, I'm never just, turn myself off of everybody and just spend some time with me. So last night I watched that missing, that movie missing on Netflix and did my little nails. I redid them because they was peeling. I wasn't feeling it. So I wanted them to look nice for Caden's little graduation thing. So I just did this little, this little, this little nudie color. I like it actually. So I'm not happy that my feet are a different color. So let's see if, how long that lasts. Anyways, let me get in here and feed my baby, get him ready. I just wanted to talk to y'all for a second because sometimes I'm just I'm not I'm I'm not perfect all the time. And I know a lot of people always are like, Aaliyah, how do you do it? How are you always going? And it's like it's it's less about how in more of like, how can't I, you know what I'm saying? Like, I can slow up life, you know what I'm saying? I can, I can make life easier for me, which in turn makes life harder for my kids, you know? And making life hard for me makes my little kids lives easier. Making my life easier would then in turn make my kids life harder because then they're not in all the things that they need to help themselves, you know? I don't know y'all some days I just feel defeated when today's one of those days so I'm gonna go feed Kai Kai I also have not eaten today yet and it's almost 11 o'clock I'll see you guys later y'all mm. If it's not one thing, it's another in my fucking life. Let me ask you something. Like, um, and not me. I mean, all the way inside. And then realizing that I had 
Okay, there's Tella. Sorry, I have to get out this dang old driveway. But not me forgetting Caden's cello. Caden forgot to grab his cello out of the car. I got home, realized his dang old cello was here. I mean, next sitting next to me. We have a performance today. Y'all, I can't make this stuff up. Today's just like, what is going on? Good thing that Good thing my kids school is literally like two minutes from my house. Cause if this is a far school, I may have been out of luck. Like, I just went, listen, I got Kaikai out and everything. I'm gonna look over and I was like, that's not supposed to be there. So here I am. I'm about to pull up to school, drop this off, and then I'm taking a nap. Like, y'all not gonna see me for a couple hours. Cause I need to recoup from today. I saw I need it. Oh my God, they cut down a tree. Anyway, I'll see y'all here. Probably when I'm on my way to pick my kids up because I'm going home. I honestly know I lied because I'll probably be up at like 1.30. Kids. Okay. Happy Wednesday, Zach. Oh my God.